Howdy, 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 my darling Libra. How are you doing, darling? My name is Simply Velka, and today we're going to get into your weekly tarot reading for June, darling. All right, happy pride, all right? So if you enjoy this tarot reading here today, Libra, be sure to give this tarot reading a like and subscribe. Be sure to check out your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign, Libra, so you get the full spectrum of what's going down in your life in specific, okay? But other than that, let's just jump right into your tarot reading here today, all right? Let's see what's going on for you guys at this current point in time, Libra. Very good cards coming out here. I mean, very fabulous cards coming in here for you, Libra. All right. <laughs> very fabulous. What you have in the back of the deck is the Seven of Air or the Seven of Swords because air is sword energy. This talks about plans needing revision. More going on that meet than meets the eye and poor timing here. I get this sense for you, Libras, where some of you guys need to just be on the lookout. I feel like your spiritual team is trying to put a spotlight on the situation that you want to to start doing some edits on you might be noticing certain people starting to act different libra uh you might be noticing just your situation in your environment in your job in the home life there's something that's starting to act a little bit uh <laughs> i want to say a little bit queer but in the sense of where it's, something's acting odd but um maybe that sounds a little bit too weird nowadays but it's like it's something it's like spirit is showing to me that they're trying to make something be stand out as much as possible to bring your attention to it all right libra what i want you guys to be paying attention to at this time is paying attention to what your how your spiritual team communicates with you you know some of your spiritual team might be communicating through repetitive numbers they might be communicating through animals you might be noticing certain animals popping up perhaps like a ladybug or, or even lizards or cardinals libra whatever the case is your spiritual team is trying to warn you of something trying to just draw your attention to something to really uh start um taking care of that issue all right and we're going to pull some more clarifying cards with this later on but let's just get to this current spread here let's take a look at your strengths we have the two of fire coming in here the two of wands and this card talks about you coming into your own new partnerships or contracts and continue moving forward libra and so what you guys don't see the potential for you guys uh libra is like i feel like you guys are investing your energy into situations that uh that are not for your betterment and it's like spirits like looking at what it is that you're doing and they're just like hey they're trying to draw your attention to this two of fire to this two of wands i feel like some of you guys are resisting this uh path here libra whether this is through paralysis by over analysis here or whether you it's this sense of where almost this sense of where you're afraid of communicating what it is that you're wanting of shooting your shot here libra i get this sense of where it's like closed mouths do not get fed libra all right closed mouths do not get fed and so you need to be willing to start asking for help you need to be willing to start communicating with other people and trying to work on collaborations communicating with your boss if there's like a problem in the uh in your work environment as well all right libra because the thing about it is like asking you shall receive is what is what this is really making me think about asking you shall receive you have a very strong um what is it you have a very strong uh ability to charm people libra and i feel like you guys need to lean into this more and give it give yourself more credit libra in your charm aspect darling because people want to help you people want to <laughs> i guess i'm going to say this um people want to serve you um is what came to mind but it kind of sounds a little <laughs> funny to me people want to help you people want to serve you but you have to make it known libra i get the sense that you guys need to take more risks as well all right take more risks you have the page of air page of swords coming in for you this card says challenging information libra delays or changes to plans and truth delivered without tact so the thing about this is libra just like in the same token that you are extremely charming in the same way you know how to cut to the core of a situation all right i feel like some of you guys are able to see through the flaws in individuals all right you might be even noticing already where 
where spirit was trying to bring a lot spotlight to certain situations certain people and you you are putting a note a mental note in your brain where you're just like okay like you know this person's not for my betterment you know you can't trust this person you know whatever the case is here it's like your guard is up or at the very least you're aware about how the situations are playing out right you're very aware about things here and so perhaps this is more so like your spiritual team trying to give this extra affirmation to you libra and letting you know that you are not crazy and what it is that you are sensing all right but I feel like you guys are getting called to be very blunt with the situation here. All right. This is also a card of communicating, letting, uh, speaking your truth here, right? We have all these blue crystals, darling, this lapis and sodalite going on here, uh, Libra. So definitely work on your throat chakra. This is really the epitome of the throat chakra. I also get the sense here with this dynamic of the two of fire, Libra again it's like we go back to the same thing about where it's like asking you shall receive and it's like part of the reason why you are going to be able to receive such beautiful opportunities such beautiful offers what have what have you libra is due to the fact um that you already are uh, garnering attention from the right people from the important people that can really uh help you get to those contracts help you get to that uh job security and what have you again libra i don't feel like you guys realize like how much attention you bring by just naturally being yourself libra all right and for some of you guys as well you don't want to speak your truth just because you might feel like you're the, like the crazy one or what have you here libra but again it's like you like you having your truth be heard is going to be received so positively by so many other people by you uh, letting the world know what it is that you want to accomplish what it is that you want to do you'll be very impressed by how the universe responds to that and brings forth the resources to really get it get you through the door and going talking just about that we have the nine of water the nine of cups coming in here for you libra all right this card talks about a wish coming true Con concerns fading away and a love life all right some of the people that y'all are garnering attention from especially for my single libras are people that are very much so um starstruck is the word i want to use is, is not want is not the exact word i want to use but um it goes back into that sense of charming uh how charming people find you libra all right even if we're going to dismiss the love aspect of it for those that are not looking for love because not everything is about love libra I still want to lean into this more so in the sense of where it's like there's a lot of people around you that want to connect with you in a more intimate way but for whatever the reason is the communication is just lacking there all right and so we need to be willing to work on that a little bit here we talk about the wishes coming true and concerns fading away for you all right and this goes again right back to if you were to just ask for help you the universe will definitely help you get through the door and get you to whatever it is that you're wanting all right all right, Libra, you guys have very strong capabilities in terms of uh, utilizing the resources around you and utilizing the attention that you bring. All right. So y'all, you Libras, you guys need to really make uh, use of that gift that you have, that gift of being charming, that gift of uh, people just wanting to help you, the gift of where people look up to you, Libra, because I get the sense of looking up to you because I don't feel like it's a mistake that like starstruck was a word that came to mind. But there's like a, another word that I want to have where it's just like it's like love at first sight, but it's not necessarily love. Uh, where it's just this sense of like people finding you just like being very attracted to you libra all right so let's start unpacking all this here we have the five of cups the ace of wands with the spirit of wands coming in here for you libra all right <clears throat> what i get here libra is that as you continue on by um utilizing your resources as you continue on down your path i feel as if people that have been around you that you've accepted in your life at some point in time libra you're going you just need to be aware about how people are reacting to your success towards you getting what it is that you're wanting all right i feel like some people are going to be looking at you libra and trying to judge you well not trying they are judging you libra in the sense of being like oh what does libra do what does libra have to deserve this what does libra do to deserve this it's like you're making a lot of people jealous through the attack 
attention that you are going to be having in the coming days here, all right? And so what I suspect for some of you Libras is that part of the reason why you don't want to ask for help or why you don't want to network is due to the people that you have communicated with and networked with in the past and those that are with you in your current space and time here, all right? But this is a, it's the sense you're getting the blessing from the universe and letting you know that it's just like, hey, like it's time to, you've been going, you've been actively evolving Libra and it's time for you to shed your skin fully and that skin kind of looks like letting go of a lot of those connections that would bring some type of shame to you or make you feel bad or make you just regret darling of even communicating with any type of new person here all right just be very cautious about those that are around you be very cautious about your environment because i just see a lot of i don't want to give this the energy of calling it like a tower moment but i feel like you're gonna have very many tower moments with certain people and you just kind of want to just like see that as being like all right the universe is showing to me that i cannot trust this person and the universe is showing to me that this is time for me to move on from them all right again we have this ace of wands coming in here for you libra and so this ace of wands is a card of lust all right in a social dynamic people again are finding you extremely attractive at this time and i don't think you realize this i mean i even know uh with the alignments of the planets right now uh for us libras especially during this time our love life is very uh, just not love life just in specific but just relationships in general are the best that it's been in about two years libra all right and so start leading uh leaning into this energy i know for my Libras, it's going to be a little bit of a struggle just because like uh, just astrologically, it's been about for the past like three years, Libra, three or four years that uh, it's been a very like we our planets have been aligned in a way where it's just like we are all of our lessons have come through relationships. That's where our trials and tribulations have really come from. And so uh, it's naturally I feel like you're in this fight or flight state because of how long that's been where you're walls are up trust issues are had right but you're getting the blessing from the universe and letting you know that's just like hey they're going to be revealing the snakes but just in the same way that they reveal the snakes to you libra they're going to be revealing the proper people to you because and not even just revealing it because you already are gathering that attention from people i feel like you just have to um be willing to open up to it a little bit more vocalizing it more communicating with people more networking more all right because you are garnering attention from the right people due to how charming you are but libra that's the tarot reading that i have for you darling all right i hope you enjoyed this tarot reading here today if you did be sure to give this video a like and subscribe um as well as check out your sun moon rising and venus sign if you want to book a private reading with me libra simply velka dot com linked down below next to my social medias tiktok and instagram both being simply welcome but until next time libra i love you so much darling bye